Good morning, YouTube. Happy Sunday. So today I want to talk about these record temperatures that we have been experiencing so far this summer. Now, we know it's summer and summer is supposed to be hot. That's, you know, that's what summer means pretty much. But um, it, we have had record temperatures, especially the month of June. Um, and uh, as a result, um, there has been some... Um, unfortunate deaths due to the heat. Um, just as my this picture here says, we just experienced the hottest June on record and it's part of a larger troubling trend. So, um, a dangerous and deadly heat wave is gripping nearly more than half of the U.S. tens of millions are set to boil in record-setting high temperatures this weekend. So this past weekend, it was, you know, it was record-setting uh, high temperatures um, and this was from the midwest uh, let's see uh, with heat advisories or warnings in effect from the uh, midwest to much of the east coast the heat uh, wave is already blamed for six deaths uh, unfortunately um, and this is what it feels like if you can see on this on this picture if you can see this picture um, it's 99 degrees in Boston but it feels like 105 um, and as you can see, same in New York and, um, different places on down, like I said, it ranged from the East coast where I am, um, through the, the Midwest, um, like I said, record breaking temperatures. Um, and as it was, as a result, uh, of this heat wave, um, up to 200 uh, million people could be affected from central U S to the East coast. At least six deaths were blamed on excessive heat. Four people uh, died in Maryland, while one died in Arizona, um, and another died in Arkansas. Uh, several events were canceled in New York City, including the OZY Fest and the New York uh, City uh, uh, Triathlon. So um, I would just like to encourage everyone who can hear me or hear this message, uh, please share it with your friends or, you know, you don't have to share them the video uh but just share with your friends to be careful of course when you walk outside you can feel the heat so you don't have to tell them it's hot uh, but just let them know that it is deadly hot um i went outside last week um i just stepped out to um my daughter and her friend little, her little boyfriend y'all uh he came to check on her car um because something was wrong with her car and it's been parked over here for a while and uh, he came to look at her car and um, I stood out there with them for about 15 minutes and the front of my shirt was wet. Now, I'm a sweater anyway, but uh, since I've been taking my vitamin D, I haven't been sweating as bad. But uh, I came in the house and I thought something was wrong with me. I was like, oh, my God, is something wrong with me? Am I going through the change? Is this the, is this the change? Y'all know I'll be 50 next year. I'm pretty proud of it. So I'm thinking this is some early menopause stuff. But it turned out that it's, it's just it's the heat. It was it was a very hot day, um, even though it was saying that it was only 90 degrees. It actually felt like, you know, uh, 100 degrees. Um, and we're used to the heat in North Carolina. They're not counseling anything here in North Carolina due to the heat. Nothing's being kept because we are used in the Carolinas, uh, north and south, of which both I claim, um, they're not counseling anything because of this heat because, again, it's, we're down south. We're used to it. But, uh, but I would like to encourage everyone to be careful. Drink plenty of water. Um, make sure you're drinking plenty of water um, and that you're staying hydrated. Please use sunblock. Please, please, please use sunblock. Protect your skin um, from the sun and, and from this heat. Okay? So, um, enjoy your day. Just keep in mind as the temperatures rise to make sure you're um, doing everything to take care of yourself. Now, we're supposed to get a break next week. The temperatures are going to drop next week, um, but it's going to be into Tuesday or Wednesday before we you know, can feel any of that um, reduction of heat or whatever you want to call it. So we, we are going to get a break here. But in the meantime, everyone be safe, be careful, be mindful. Have a great day. God bless you.